Hello friends, this video on determinant part 6 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 5. Sample of determinant of a matrix of order 3. So now you can see that second row has maximum 0. So I will try to expand using this. It will ease my calculation. So what the value will be, you take the first element 0 and then this matrix which you get is you remove other elements, you get this guy, minus 1, minus 2, minus 5, 0, plus, again the second element is 0, you write other elements which you get after removing, you remove this guy, you get this guy, 3, minus 2, 3 and 0, why? Because if you take this guy, you remove these two lines, you get 1, 2, 3, 4 elements, then you take minus 1, and i plus j here will be this guy is a 2 3 correct so this guy will be into minus 1 to the power 5 why because the element is this guy minus 1 into minus 1 to the power 5 into the value now now this determinant will be you remove this guy and this guy you get these four values so it will be 3 minus 1 3 and minus 5 Correct. So these we are not much bothered because 0 into some value will become 0 only. So the output will be 0 plus 0 plus and this minus 1 into 1. Minus 1 into minus 1 is again 1 into multiply the diagonals 3 into minus 5 subtract with the remaining number 3 into minus 5. Correct. So this guy is nothing bad. Right. Minus 15 plus 3. And that way is nothing but minus 2 and that is minus 3. So what I have done, I found that row 2 was having maximum number of zeros. So I expanded this along row 2. The first element becomes 0 into this again 0. This guy is 0 into this again 0. This guy minus 1 into minus 1 to the power 5 a to the power 2 plus 3. See here also you have to do minus 1 to the power this guy is a to 1, 3 and this guy is minus 1 to the power a, this guy is 2, 2, a to 2, minus 1 to the power 2 plus 2, 4. But since this is multiplied by 0, so I am not even bothered about these because anyway 0 into that will become 0. So you can ignore this also, you should not waste time on writing these numbers, you can just say 0 plus 0, that's all because end of the day this becomes 0. The only number we are concerned about this, that's why we wrote everything here. This guy is nothing but a to 3. This guy is minus 1 to the power 2 plus 3 and this is the 2 by 2 determinant we got after removing these elements 3 minus 1, 3 minus 5, 3 minus 1, 3 minus 5 and then we got this value of determinant by multiplying diagonals and subtracting the remaining numbers and I got the value as minus 12. Let me take a couple of more examples because this determinant of order 3 is a little critical and we will be doing this. Uh, many times so let's have a little clear concept on this so now similar thing we'll do here since there is no zeros we can try any one I like expanding using rows it's simpler for me so I'll use this so this guy if you see will become the first element is uh, I'll write in this fashion now this guy is a11 a12 a13 and this guy is, I don't need to write because I just want to know what is the value of these. So, or oh, let me write here only 1 1. For the first case, we'll pick this guy, correct, and then we'll delete these guys. For the second case, I'll write here a 11, a 12, a 13, 1 1 minus 2, 2 3. The second case, I'll pick this guy, I'll delete these guys. And for the third case, I will pick this uh, A13 and I'll delete these guys. And I'll add all the values. So this becomes A11, that is 3 here, 3 into minus 1 to the power A11, that is 1 plus 1. Correct. 
into this matrix which I got 1 minus 2 3 1 correct sorry straight line no edge straight plus this guy now a 1 to that is minus 4 minus 4 into minus 1 to the power a 1 to 1 plus 2 and the matrix which I got is 1 minus 2 2 1 1 minus 2 plus this guy a 1 3 that is 5 5 into minus 1 to the power 1 plus 3 that is 4 and then this matrix this guy 1 1 2 3 1 1 2 3 so that is my answer I just have to simplify this now 3 into minus 1 to the power 2 that is 3 and this you have to multiply the diagonal subtract with the remaining number 1 into 1 is 1 minus minus 3 into minus 2 is minus 6 plus minus 4 into this guy is 1 plus 2 correct because a1 to minus 4 into minus 1 is again 4 into multiply diagonals 1 into 1 minus 2 into minus 2 is minus 4 plus 5 into 1 is 1 again multiply diagonals 3 into 1 is 3 minus 2 into 1 is 2 so what I have got is this is 3 into 7 plus 4 into 5 plus 5 into 1 that is what we have got simplify this further 7 to 3 is 21 5 into 4 is 20 and 5 into 1 is 5 and this is nothing but 46 and that is my answer so what I have done I have just expanded using row 1 and got the answer thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests Get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.